going? I'm Aaron from Scorpion Child. I'm here to talk with you about some songs on the album. I wrote that song. Uh, that song came from an acid trip that happened a couple years back. That's the twisted nature of its riff and subject matter. That's an interesting tune. It's got kind of an old flair to it. Uh, it's basically about a, a place where, like a civilization, where we can go to see the end of the world happen together in um, peace. That song's just basically about a spot that I would go to with a friend who sits past, you know, where we get away, get away from the problems of the day to day, fight. Yeah, that one's kind of a mixture of a lot of different things going on. Musically, that song is interesting because it doesn't follow a traditional structure pattern. Um, I think I think it leads well into a song like Liquor because Liquor just kind of throws you in a different direction. Uh, that's that's basically. We had a friend this past week pass away. Um, that exact problem, drinking too much, um, rest his soul. And the Antiax, it's, you know, it's, it's, it's a ballad of sorts, you know, it definitely discusses some darker things than a traditional ballad, ballad discusses, um, it's an interesting kind of you know, Slade sounding, Big Star sounding, Jam. I love that stuff too. The way I feel about that one, it's, it's, a, it's a love song. Paradigms of that, it's just more. It's, I guess it's more, uh, more of an upbeat song. It kind of discusses. It's kind of more of a political, interpolitical kind of song. So that one's a suicide. Yeah, you know. Continuation of the dark subject matter that we like to embalm ourselves in. Um, I wrote the lyrics to that basically about, you know, a girl that just basically she, she didn't want to live. Um, so she did. An interesting way to bring it, like bring it back with the, the locusts and at the end of the album and then at the beginning of the album. It's like a cycle. It's like a full, like 24-hour cycle or like a life cycle. And like the events of the songs and their subject matter definitely reflect that cyclical kind of vibe. Um, hence the record cover. You know, I saw the end as the past right there. Basically, the beginning and the end of something would be the best way to like wrap up the nature of the album without giving up too much detail. You know, letting letting the listener enjoy the album, the record's content for what it is, and you know, forming 
each other up based on that. 